Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Samantha. Today I'm trying to sit back a little bit further than I usually do because I want to share with you a Primark haul and I want to make sure that you can see everything that I've got to share with you. Now it is going to be a substantial haul because I've got two overflowing bags here. This is probably four bags worth of but I've condensed it into two for ease of me getting to the products. Um, the first item uh, is a throw and now on my sofas I have two cream and they're like teddy bear throws. One of them I've washed a number of times and with these teddy bear throws if you do wash them um, they tend to go quite flat so I've had to replace it and I went into Primark and I found this one so it's actually a large throw it didn't have any label on it no tag or anything like that um it wasn't wrapped up usually they have them bundled up with you know like a bow on them there was nothing like that on there and um, there was about four or five of them and i liked it i hope you can see this it's like got like a brick weave pattern on there uh, I really, really liked it, and this was only six pounds, and this works perfectly. I mean, it's huge, basically. That is half, um, and it is, yeah, really, really huge, lovely and warm. I like to watch Netflix and things like that, and then just have that over me. Um, and then the next items, again, a couple of homeware items. Now. I'd seen on a couple of Primark hauls some hot water bottles. Now I really can't stand the hot water bottles where you have, you know, just the uh, rubber container. I really don't like that, especially if you're going to put really hot water in them, they are extremely hot. So when I saw on some other Primark hauls that Primark has some really nice hot water bottles available and they were very reasonably priced, I had a look and I was even more surprised with the um, the styles of hot water bottles that they had actually. The one that I went for for me was this one. So it's multicolored in these pastel shades. So you've got purple, where's that pink? No, that yeah, that one's purple. Purple, blue, you've got like a, a light orange and a cream shade in there. I really like that. You do get the rubber hot water bottle inside as well. And this was six pounds. So I really like that. And then for my, when my grandchildren come over to stay, I wanted to get one for them. And I went for this one. Now I'd seen an owl um, which initially that was what I was going to get actually but when I went in there they had really they had a really good choice so they had this little dog which I love and again you've got a mini well, it's not as big as that hot water bottle um, that I shared with you they're like mini or medium sized hot water bottles really like this because of the dog there was also a pink rabbit which I think I'm going to have to get um, for when the my granddaughters stay over. Really excited about getting that actually because that was gorgeous. But I went with one. I have tested it out and yeah, really, really good quality. There was no leaks, anything like that. And for six pounds, I really love it. <laughs> really, really good. On the back, all you do is open it up and then slip the top. I'm not going to do it now, but there, I just want to prove that there is a rubber hot water bottle in there. And yeah, I really really like those now the next um, I think actually I've got one more piece of homeware to share with you um, now I love I don't usually use candles in the summer but I really do like once the weather gets a little bit cooler and the nights start drawing in I really like to have a candle going and I came across this one and it is the it's £1.50, it's pink, which I love, and it's a scented candle, which I don't usually go for, but this one says number 43 Vintage Blossom, which is lily and honeysuckle, and it says burns up to 50 hours. Now, it looks like that, and it smells so gorgeous, absolutely beautiful. Now, usually, I'm not really one for um, scents. I, you know, I, I really love, the and i've forgotten what they're called now reed diffusers i think they're called i don't mind those um but i'm not that keen on a lot of scents um 
in candles but this one really did smell very very nice so it looks like that and for £1.50 I thought yeah it's definitely worth a try now I've also seen a lot about these boots on YouTube other Primark calls and these well to be honest I wasn't intending on getting a pair of boots but I saw these and I had to have them so they are like this and I believe they are a dupe for a designer boot I don't know what that boot is but I believe it's a dupe for a designer boot um, and I really like them they look good on they've got a little heel which I like I don't want them really completely flat but I also don't want them high I just find wearing heels very very comfortable especially if you're having to walk a long way you know I prefer comfort and I thought these are really stylish and comfortable. And the great thing about these were, now they did have red and they did have black as well, but these ones were the only ones on sale. They are originally 16 pounds, but I picked them up for half price at eight pounds and I picked up a size five, my regular size, and they fit very, very well. Now, although usually I go for more of a rounded toe, these do actually, um, they are very, very comfortable. I really like the buckles, I like the stars, and yeah, really love those. Now the next is, and it's a little bit covered in fur from the jumpers, um, is, and I mentioned this yesterday, that I've got, in fact, in my favourites, one of my favourites were, were these, and I've got them right beside me, and they are these black shoes now i've also got the burgundy and i've been wearing these to death because i love them with my jeans or they look really really good with white my white skinny jeans as well but i really want to wear the burgundy and my other black skinny jeans are a little bit faded because i love wearing those in the winter so i had to pick up a another pair so i did and i picked up these in a size 16 they are only seven pounds I got them in the skinny I really really like them and I'm not sure if I should have gone for a 14 or a 16 it just depends really on the stretch if I, I can get away with a 14 if there is a lot of stretch to it because I really do like my skinny jeans skinny um, but I went with a 16 but they do feel quite stretchy so we'll have to see so I may be going back and getting a 14 it just really depends on the stretch of these um, but they are just black skinny jeans love them for seven pounds what i really wanted to try but i um but they were a little bit more expensive they had some jeggings in the black but they were quite thick and but they were 10 pounds and to be honest i thought well i usually get these they're only seven pounds so i thought i'd stick with those i then picked up um another couple of homeware bits um, I picked up these. Now, I use a hot cloth cleanser morning and night to either remove my makeup or obviously clean my face first thing in the morning. And I always use a, you know, the cloth that goes along with that hot cloth uh, cleanser. <laughs> um, but to be honest, I find that they are so expensive and, you know, it's just a a cloth it's just a face cloth so I saw in Primark that they had these they're not the luxury face cloths um, they are the regular but they were only I haven't got the price on but they were only one pound 20 each and I picked up the fuchsia pink and the gray because I thought these two colors will work together you know if I'm hanging them up in the bathroom or I just like the combination to be honest and you get three in a pack and I thought I could use these and they've also got a little obviously I'm not going to really scrub my face <laughs> with them but they they're toweling so they're going to you know sloth off any dead skin cells that I might have as well so I'll just give you a close-up of those so you can see that they are toweling but they don't have the price but they are worth £1.20 because I, I remember thinking wow that is an absolute bargain now, I did a jumper haul uh, last week and 
<laughs> to be honest, I am obsessed at the moment with jumpers from Primark, especially those fluffy ones. And I've got now a red one. I've got a, what other colors have I got? Because I'm gonna confuse myself with what I've got in the bag and what I've already got. But I've definitely got the red one. I know the blue one I've got. Um, but when I went, and I went to Cambridge at the weekend, and in there they had even more colors so i had to get more because not only do i love the fit of them i really like them because they're fluffy but they're not itchy and they're not really really thick they are quite a thin jumper well they're not you know they're like a medium um so they're not thick they're not thin but they're really fluffy and they are only 10 pounds each i've now decided that i prefer the fit of the extra large just because the extra large gives me a little bit more length and I did get a couple in the large and the length is just not there for what I want so I've gone for extra large and this I, I was just blown away by this colour I don't know why but I'm really into bright colours at the moment and this is the colour <laughs> fluff everywhere um, this is the colour that I went for. In fact, I've got a couple more of these to share with you, but I went with this straight away um, because I just love it and it is extra large. I'm not going to be able to show you um, the length, but the back is longer than the front. And I just thought, wow, that is just a stunning fuchsia colour. They are calling this one just pink. It's got a V neck, which I find very, very flattering. And although these are thin because they've got I mean medium, they're not thin, they're not thick. And they do have holes all the way down the front, exactly where that ticket is. That's the design feature of them. Um, I don't have to necessarily wear a t-shirt under these, so you don't see a bra, you, you know, your bra through it, even though it's quite, it's, it's not, um, you know, really a dense knit. So really love that color. Then I went for, now I was trying to keep away from baby pink, but to be honest, I've now picked up every single colour in this apart from the lilac. Every single colour that I um, have come across, I've picked up because I just love these jumpers so, so much. So I went with the baby pink as well. So that's exactly the same as the fuchsia pink that I've just shared with you, but they're calling this one blush. So again, I picked it up in extra large just because I love it oversized. These are so gorgeous. Now you can see that they are quite a, you know, they're not a dense knit, but when you've got these on, they really feel so cozy and warm and I just love them. So that's the blush. Now I want to share with you something slightly, it's still a jumper. I'm obsessed with jumpers at the moment. Um, but I want, I saw this in the Cambridge and it's a chenille jumper. Now, I don't have a lot of luck with chenille. I tend to find that it really does shed everywhere. But I've tried this with a black uh, cami underneath and it hardly shed at all. I've tried it on and I just love it. And the colour of this really, really is fantastic. In fact, people were just grabbing these in the store lots of people and this is the jumper that i'm talking about it's 13 pounds again i've gone in yeah extra large these are a little bit shorter than the really fluffy ones still long sleeves they've got a cuff to it as well really like that because it grabs at my wrist because i've got absolutely tiny wrists um it's a round neck this time, but this is so flattering, even though it's quite a boxy jumper. Uh, a similar length all the way round. I just love this gold shade. Let me just see what they're calling this one. They are calling this one yellow. And yeah, it really, you know, stood out in the store. It's beautiful, shiny. It looks gorgeous on, love, love, love that. Then I saw it in the pink and I thought, wow. And to be honest, I just couldn't choose um, between them. So uh, I went for the pink as well and they are calling this one blush again. Again, I got it in the extra large, 
just because the f it fits and hangs nicely on me. Uh, again, exactly the same as the yellow one, round neck, long sleeved with the cuff, just beautiful, looks wonderful with skinny jeans. And again, I mean, even when I go like that, there's no chenille coming off it, just a tiny bit, but nothing. I mean, nothing like, I think I had, what did I have a couple of weeks ago? Was it a scarf or something? And as soon as I took it out of the bag, you could literally feel all the fibers going, you know, into the back of your throat. And I can't stand that. So um, yeah, really, really pleased with these. I thought I was going to actually have to return those just because I thought when I get home the you know the wool is just going to fly everywhere but I'm so pleased because I love the look of those uh, and I hope I said the price they were both 13 pounds now then um, something else that is in the um, like the cardigan <laughs> I mean I'm just obsessed with keeping warm at the moment um, now this is a really long cardigan um, I don't think I'm going to be able to show you I'll just see if I can stand up um, it is so so long but it comes down between my thigh and um, basically my thigh and my knee so it's not you know one of those cardigans that goes right down to your ankle um, but it's absolutely gorgeous I love it it's that fluffy material and it is let me just see what they're calling this blush again I had to go for extra large but I could have done with a large in this one because they only had three of these there's none of these in the Norwood store there was three of these in the blush they do have cream as well but um, this one was calling me and uh, yeah they only had three left in extra large so I picked this up in extra large I absolutely love it absolutely gorgeous love it you've got pockets there there's no buttons or anything. It's one of those ones that, you know, you just let fall at the front. You don't do it up or anything like that. And I just love it so, so much. And that one was 13 pounds. Now I wore this the other day, not this one, but I did get this in the large and it was this jumper, but I returned it for an extra large because I just liked um, the, length of the extra large rather than the large so uh, I went back and I returned it thankfully I left the tags on and I was able to return it very very easily um, but I just like the length and the fit better of the large obviously you've seen that before it's that beautiful fluffy jumper as seen in glamour and you know it's 10 pounds you've seen it before i've even worn it in my video if you're a regular viewer but i had to get the extra large it just fit a lot better for me but primark are so good it's so easy to return um you know they never make a fuss about it and i just i just find the store as a whole very very easy not only to shop in um but also to return anything if, if you know necessary so then we move on to the second bag Again, there's a running theme here because <laughs> there's a running theme because of, um, you know, the fact that I'm just loving jumpers at the moment. And I picked up this. Sorry, my microphone is, as usual, pulling my jumper down. So um, this is the next one. Now, it looks quite a, you know, just a, a basic jumper. It's burgundy, quite long, quite boxy. But what is fantastic about these are these tulip sleeves. It really is, you know, a lovely, well, it is a lovely jumper, but it is quite plain. You've got splits at the side, but the sleeves are just what um, made me think this is going to look gorgeous. And I actually um, mistakenly picked this one up in the large. And um, yeah, I mistakenly picked it up in the large but it actually fits very, very nicely. I love it. Um, and I'm so pleased that I got the large because I think, sorry, this is just annoying me how it's falling with the microphone. Um, yeah, if I got the extra large, I think it would have been not as nice, but it really does fit beautifully, gorgeous, and I love it. And it's got a little bit of a turtleneck going on there and this one was 10 pounds which is very very good value 
Now this one, um, actually I'll show you this one first because this is what I picked up first. This is another as seen in Glamour and they've got quite a number of uh, these tags. I've already worn this um, because as soon as I purchased it, I wore it the, the next day because I loved it so much. And it is this, again, I'll stand up and it's another very long line cardigan. I hope you can see that. Um, it's slightly different. You've got that ribbed effect there. It's long sleeved with the cuff there. Again, it's got nothing, um, you know, no buttons or anything like that going down it. It was, now let me have a look at this tag because I've got another color to show you. Um, it's £13. Now I purchased this first of all and wore this but it looks so lovely on and I got this in the extra large as well. I possibly could have done with a large um, but to be honest you know I just like being cosy in the winter and this colour really really spoke to me. As I mentioned when I went um, a couple of weeks ago or a week ago, I'm getting confused because I've been to Primark so much recently, um, there was quite a number of ladies actually wearing this colour which you know it's definitely out of my comfort zone but I just loved it absolutely beautiful color and because I loved that so much this would be the color that I went for ordinarily and I thought I'm gonna to have to pick this up because I just loved the other one so much and at the moment yeah the weather's not um, too it's not too cold but it's not warm you need you can't go out without like a cardigan on or something like that um, so to be honest these are going to be very very good at the moment because you can just pop them on with uh, a pair of jeans and they're going to look gorgeous so this is the other color I'm sure they called that one green and they're calling this one mint but it's more of that sort of um, duck egg blue type of thing rather than mint it, exactly the same you know it's a long cardigan you can see the tag as seen in glamour there again 13 pounds it comes down between you know in in the middle of my knee and my hip um, that kind of length and yeah really really love it and it's very cozy if you can see that close close up it's it's not a flat wool it's got a little bit of fluffiness to it gorgeous love that then I picked up this now I don't ordinarily wear a lot of hats but in the winter especially if it's really cold and to be honest in Norfolk we really don't get that much um, too much cold because we are if you look at the UK map we are stuck right out there on the right and we are very very close or we're the closest part of the UK to France you know you, you still have to travel by boat but um, you know we are the closest <clears throat> um, so it, it does we do have really good weather here uh, although obviously it's more autumnal at the moment so I don't usually wear hats but this one really spoke to me it's only four pounds I really like the color I love the pearls I love the price four pounds you could also get now it's either grey or cream I'm just seeing if yeah it was four pounds so it's either grey or cream that you could get as well but this one I just loved it and I don't even think they're calling it a certain colour they're calling it nude actually um, but yeah really really love that and the pearls on it are cream and greys and different sizes as well and I just thought it's very very feminine and gorgeous for a hat with a beautiful large pink pom-pom so that was that then i picked up this now as you know um <laughs> i'm really loving that mustard color at the moment and i thought this would look really nice if i was wearing a black t-shirt black my black skinny jeans and then this long cardigan over the top so again it's a long cardigan this one has pockets um, it's that thin wool this time and it's quite a dense knit you've got a rib down each side there um, you've got the long sleeves with a cuff and yeah it's one of those ones that are quite slouchy quite baggy um, 
I'm not going to open it up because you, because you won't be able to see any of it. But it's and this was only eight pounds. They did have other colours in it. I think there was black, um, but this one really really spoke to me because I thought again it's that colour that you can wear. Um, and they're calling it mustard so I can wear my black which I love to wear and then I can add this as a pop of color really love it and it's so slouchy and gorgeous love that now this I was quite undecided on in the store again it's one of those as seen in glamour magazine but um, it's not a colour that I would ordinarily go for, but obviously I'm trying to get out of my comfort zone. I have got a few blush pink pieces, but I am now wearing different things. And to be honest, you know, it is, um, you know, I really, really love the fact that Primark has got such vibrant colours there. They've got their blush pinks, they've got the you know the regular blacks and so forth um, but they're really coming out with some brilliant shades and I'm loving it and this it just looks like a basic jumper this was the last one I could find in the extra large again like I say it's as seen in glamour it's just a regular knit you can see that I've gone for extra large like I say, it was the only large, uh, extra large one there. Um, it's got the cuff there, but when you turn it round, so this is the back, you've got these two bits of, um, I don't know what you'd call, in, call them, but um, they've got this ring detail going across them and it really does look very flattering. So although, yes, it's a very bright color and they're calling it, they are calling it orange but it looks really really good with blue jeans and I love it and the back is slightly let me just stand up again slightly longer than the front so that's that one and that one was 13 pounds if I didn't mention that now we've got some more fluffy jumpers so as I said I picked up that really bright fuchsia pink I've got every colour now and these are the other colours well I picked up every single colour apart from the lilac because these are so nice just to wear at home they're lovely to wear out um, yeah love them so I picked up the extra large in the cream so exactly the same you can actually see the whole detail running down the front in this one better um, so that's the cream and they are calling it ivory so exactly the same then I picked up I had to go for this one I went for the black because I love black love this so so much just exactly the same but in black and then the very last one and all these fluffy jumpers that I'm sharing with you today are 10 pounds and then the very very last one is and they're calling this one grey and this is one of my favorites it is just beautiful um, to be honest I had to replenish my jumper selection just because I've got hardly any jumpers um, I've just had a recent sort out and they were all a little bit tatty so I decided to splurge and get lots of jumpers I just love this grey one so so much so I think I may have enough jumpers to be going on with for a little while, but I love Primark, so reasonable. The quality is definitely there at the moment. The colors are definitely there. I'm loving it, absolutely loving Primark. And like, to be honest, I can't wait to go back. Um, I've seen another jumper that I like, not that I need any more jumpers, um, but you know, I just love looking around and seeing what new um, stock they have because to be honest if you don't grab it while you see it in Primark you've probably missed the boat because you know that they go out of stock of items very very easily so I hope you enjoyed that you did give me lots of thumbs up yesterday when I asked you and I also had messages from people um, requesting the Primark call so I hope you enjoyed that I hope it's helped you if you're looking for uh, the similar items to what I've picked up today and yeah really really loving Primark and I hope that that's helped you um, in deciding whether you want to go to Primark or not um, tomorrow I'm going to be doing um, some I'm doing some tutorials over the next couple of days I'm going to be doing a tutorial with either the Makeup Revolution Soph 
eyeshadow palette, um, either the Flawless 4 or the Rose Gold, the new chocolate rose gold palette. Um, so whatever one you would like to see of that first, you can again um, pop comments down below. No, um, you can obviously thumb up this video, I'd really love it if you did that. Um, but if you would like one of those three palettes to be featured tomorrow just let me know down below also let me know what is your favorite um, purchase from primark or what did you enjoy from this haul um, but thank you so much for watching until next time thank you bye